got arrested when I was uh, 25 years old. So I'm in my 20th year. The fact that I am here for taking someone's life, I do feel remorse. On that night, I felt that I was defending myself. When you realize that a person did this, this wasn't cancer or a sickness, this was an actual person who shot holes in your child's body. I don't want my legacy to be that I was just a murderer. I do have something to contribute. The men in the prison wanted to do a mural in the community. They saw this as a way to give back. I'm speaking as a victim or survivor. I'm not interested in what he has to say. I'm interested in my healing, my becoming whole again. We tried to come together and see how we could stop some of that pain in the community. Who are you asking forgiveness of? Everyone. Everyone in society that I have harmed. I have a real strong reaction to you asking your victim to forgive you, because I think you have no right on the face of this earth to ever ask the person you harmed to forgive you. I was trying to show the common humanity of all people. You might not want to face the commonality, but it's there. I've heard a couple different people say this. I know that, you know, I caused someone pain, but, and there is no but. I see my victim every day. Before I go to sleep and I see his face. I think some people feel, well, they don't know what happens in the prison. They don't have anybody in the prison and they don't care. But these people come back out and we need to care.